This is Dan and Sheila Rhodes, and we bring you Christmas greetings. During this uh, season of time, and um, especially in Christmas seasons, our hearts and minds go to the uh, scriptural story of the birth of Jesus. That is with the words of Isaiah. A virgin shall be with child, shall give birth to a son, and call his name Emmanuel, meaning God with us. Now that's God's message to you and to us and to everyone. God is with you no matter what the season or experience of your life is. God is with you. And I'm so glad and so grateful and so thankful that God is with us and with you. He's a God of hope. Don't mm. ever forget that. He's a God of the impossible. And uh, we hold on to that. We always hold on to that, not only through the Christmas season, but forever and always, every day, no matter what you're walking through, no matter what you're dealing with, mm -hmm. hold on to that hope, knowing that God that we love, that we serve this Christmas season, that we, you know, we shout a hallelujah. Yeah. He's our God of hope. He is, and he's working things out that we don't even know. That's he's right. always working. But well, we wish you a very, very yes. Merry Christmas and a wonderful, happy yes, New Year. Yes, we do. And yes. uh, Sheila said to me the other day that um, not only a Happy New Year, but some God surprises oh, coming yes. up. Oh, yes, God surprises. In the New Year. For the New Year. We're believing that for you. We're believing that for us. And uh, just hold on to it, because he is a God of surprises. Yes, he you is. You can't box him in. So expect some God surprises in your life and in your family. Sometimes it's like uh, I heard uh, one of our dearest friends, Bishop Kirby Clement, say recently, it's a boomerang effect when the Lord begins to move in your life and in your family. So look for some God surprises this holiday. Just a Merry Christmas for our, from yes. our home to your home. Yes, God, Merry Christmas. God bless you. Happy New Year.